What's up, Mercs? It's John here with some more Fallout Frost. Last time we cleared out the airport, and today we're checking what's down here. So, let's get a move on. Now, I'm gonna expect there are some more ghouls down here because this place was relatively overrun when we came in here. We always have to be a little bit careful, I suppose. Sunglasses. You got a duffel bag with fusion cells, a pulse grenade, which does unfortunately over encumber me, but that's okay. Let's go ahead and get rid of, I'm guessing, some junk here. Um, more rat teeth. I don't know why I have. I don't need. I'm gonna drop some of these scalpels just because, I mean, like, yeah, they're good for the surgical kit, but, like, I'm not gonna be pumping out surgical kits like a factory. I really don't need that much stuff. Chances are, it's going to be very rarely that I get all the gear together needed for a full surgical kit. Looks like we have another security terminal here. Let's turn the light off. I don't know what this this this, 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 this security terminal goes to. I kept saying skadirity. Oh, it's just more turrets up here from last time. Skadirity. What a great thing. Let's go and hack it anyway so I can get that XP. Or at least try a few times. Seize! Oh, there's five things this time. Um, Nope. Could be mines. Nope, because it's not the S at the end. So, crane. Could be crane. Yep, it is crane. Okay, turret control, and I think just activate and... I don't want to activate it, because, like, what if I activate it and they start shooting at me, you know? Like, yeah, there could be enemies down here that might help me with, but, like, I'd rather not. I don't know where I... Oh, this is the baggage collect area that we saw before. And there's a subway line, and there's also gas. Subway line. Okay, I don't know where that goes. Hmm. Maybe I do want to go back to the Federation before I go... This way. Fucking hell. Just throw it! Turret time! Are they not firing? They did activate him, right? Control, deactivate. Yeah, they're definitely activated. The question is, do they shoot at me? <laughs> I guess I answered my own question. Okay, so those are not very useful. Let's still deactivate those. <laughs> I'm gonna do right now. Okay, I'm gonna do this. Do, -do, -do controls. Uh, bash. G. I don't think there's anything that's mapped to G. And now, when I, not ah, much better. That's fucking way better. Holy shit! I should have done that like years ago. Yeah, years. Like seven years. That's how long Fallout 4 has been out, right? What happened to them all? There were a lot of ghouls over here. Let's go ahead and get the frag grenades ready to go. Okay. The fe there are festering. I do want to be careful. Ooh. Ooh. There we go. It wasn't the cleanest kill, but it was a kill. Nonetheless. More EC ammo. Chef hat. Gotta be careful, because I don't know where that festering went. At least we took out the feral ghoul right away, which is definite... Or the, uh, the feral ghoul, the glowing one right away, which is definitely the uh, the main target, I should say. Because he can revive other ghouls, which is less than ideal. Oh god. He's gonna sit up here. Hope you don't mind. better much much better yeah first thing I'm doing when I get back taking up all the sights off these guns all the scopes <gasps> festering hello 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 please don't come over here please don't come over here please don't hit me please don't hit me oh, God. There we go. 
<laughs> I thought he was gonna glitch up like any second, so I was getting like really panicky. Come on, man! Come on. Come on! Oh my god, the missed headshots are ridiculous! There we go. God damn, how many bullets did I use on one ghoul right there? Too many, that's the answer. Also, I'm sitting on my foot and it's going to sleep. This guy's still alive, apparently. <sighs> okay. Alright, alright. See, that's another reason why I don't like using the, uh, the pistol, because the pistol I don't have any of the accuracy perks for, so it's not the best thing. But when you don't have anything else that's sightless or scopeless, rather, you kind of have to deal with it. That's the information desk. Ah, it's just stuff about the airport I really could give a fuck about. So this goes to a dead end. It doesn't look like there's anything else in here. That's the way we've been before. It goes up to Terminal B, so that goes to above ground if it wasn't wrecked. And, oh great, there's a downstairs. Which looks like it used to go upstairs. I really like when there's a downstairs. Yep, that's my favorite thing. Oh, and there's traps. Oh boy, oh boy, we got people in here, don't we? Oh, there's ghouls. Wait, this one actually might be part of the subway station. I don't know. There are ghouls down there, though. Uh, did I ever pick up that bottle cap mine? Oh, good thing I remembered, because I'm going to need that now. Let's go ahead and pick that up. Why does he keep doing that, man? The textures sometimes with frost get so... Yeah. That's a good way to describe it. So, yeah. And I'm not being, like... I'm not joking. That is a good way to describe it. Because it's indescribable. Is that a pipe revolver pistol? Compensated, powerful pipe pistol. If it was a pipe revolver rifle or something, or a pipe rifle without a scope on it, I'd be taking it, but it's it's a pistol, so nope. No, thank you. Okay. Great. Too many cans. Let's go ahead and drop them. Don't really want them anyway. This one did not trigger the trap. Because that's not good. Uh, this looks like a spot that no matter what, they'll have to cross through if they're chasing me. So I just want to make sure I set something there. Mole wrap me. Might be able to cook later. There's a lot of pre-war food here. Which, I'm getting my hopes up a little bit. Ooh. Airport ID card for the employee thing, so that will activate the one airport, or the, uh, this! The one airport. This thing! The card reader. Hmm. 308, Psycho Jet, Pipe, Bolt Action, Pistol. Great, that's what I want. Going up? Going up? There's, Facility. there's more down? Oh, well, yeah, I guess technically there is, and we already know. It's right here. But, okay. I guess I can save. Yeah, might as well. It's here. Bourbon! 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 Gimme, gimme. That's what I was getting my hopes up for. Alcohol! Oh, yeah. That sweet, sweet, good stuff. Oh my gosh, there's a lot of enemies down there. It's grenade time. There you go. That's how you take out a room of ghouls. I ripped off most of their legs. That's actually really good. Fucking hell! That guy came up fast! You wanna come over here? Come on! Come on, keep coming! I don't wanna go over there because he might trigger the trap. I don't see him. He was on the stairs a second ago. Are you serious? There he is. Hey, idiot! Hey! Yeah, figure it out, you fucking idiot. Thank you! God damn! Do I have any other mines? I don't think so. Got some Molotovs. I got impact grenades. That actually might be really good here. Here, another one. Oh, uh, they might be the ones who I ripped the- oh, hi. <laughs> uh, I think I ripped the other one's legs off, so I'm pretty sure- yeah, there's a few down here that are still just, like, hanging on a little bit. There we go, level 21. Nice. A few more, maybe? Let's go ahead and take that level real quick, though. Mm, do I want to go with the strength again? Um... I can't go with chem resistant yet, can I? Where's chem resistant? Isn't that like farther down, I thought? No, that's level 22. So that's next level. So what I'm going to do right now is go over the strength again. 
which I am two strength points away from strong back. So we'll go with the strength, which is nice. Let me activate these protectrons to help me out. Let's do that. I can't break the code. No, never mind. It's, a, it's an advanced thing. Normally, they are novice. So that's a bit unfortunate for me. Money. Money. I'm gonna be careful. There's definitely still. Oh, yeah. Fucking hell. It's a festering. Okay. Wow. Impact grenades are fucking awesome. I think I can shoot through this. Yeah, you can shoot through glass in Fallout. Okay. Sure. What Fallout are you playing? That might help. Fuck me, dude. There's just keep they just keep coming. I need to check if they're downed or anything. He's dead. Okay. I might have killed one. I don't think so. Because there were definitely more there was like three of them chasing me. They must have turned around. Because there's no way I killed they their bodies just disappeared. So they're probably just like sitting down here somewhere. Unless that impact grenade took them all out, which I doubt. But yeah, it's possible, I guess. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> oh fucking hell, that was close as hell! Oh, oh, that was the same ghoul! That was his arm right there! Wow, that was close. I don't think I've ever gotten that close to getting festered, because I'm pretty sure that was a festering. Wow. What? Oh, there's one under here. Whole... Wait, what? Where the fuck is he? He must be down the elevator. Oh my god, that one was close. Okay. Alright, well, we survived it. I know there's another one in here, although he might have followed and died from the impact. I think he did. There is gas here, so I cannot fire my gun without burning myself alive. Granted, the uh, the gas explosion does not do that much damage. We've already accidentally blown ourselves up before, and it didn't kill us. It just kind of stung slightly. So whatever. Got it. Got it. And what a great what a what a great way to open the door. Got it. Miss every bullet, panicking. What is that behind me? Fuck! <laughs> Why? I just saw glowing green. <laughs> Holy fuck! <laughs> Jesus Christ! Stim pack. Of course, they didn't hit anyone, did it? Okay, Molotovs, Molotovs, I need Molotovs. <laughs> Fucking glowing one just comes out of nowhere. That's really what I need, and the bourbon wore off. That's less than good. Holy shit. Molotovs do like nothing. Okay, he's on fire, at least. He's burning. He's taking damage. Are they stuck? They're stuck. Holy shit! Oh my god! Did you. I, I just. I, ugh. I need a, I need a, I need a breather. I need a second. Okay. I just let's save, please. I need a second. I'm weary from lack of sleep, so now we're really bad off. Um, wow. What happened? Where did he even come from? I was just, you know, I was, yeah, you know, looking around. All of a sudden, my entire screen glowing green. What the fuck? That honestly scared the fuck. I that that caught me off guard more than I've ever been caught off guard before. Cause I didn't see any hint of a glowing one in there. Not at all. Until, you know, my entire screen was glowing green trying to kill something else. Another stealth boy. I'm gonna take the cryo mine. Mines are... Uh, well, I'm gonna rate mines higher than anything else. Or higher than I've ever rated mines before in any other playthrough of Fallout. Because god damn, mines are your best friend. Because ghouls can get ridiculous. Holy shit, I cannot believe I survived that. I mean, like, wow. That was unreal how lucky I got right there.
I shouldn't be alive right now. I should be dead. But I'm alive. Yep. Thank you, Stimpak. I appreciate it. Alright, now the fun part. We get to see what's down here. Yay. Can I just go back home? Going up? Wait, I thought this one down. What? No. Oh, this is just this area. Again. Oh, yeah, it just connects them. Okay, whatever. Let's go. Let's go back down. Alright. Wait, going up? Wait, how many levels are there? What the fuck? Oh my god, this place is huge. Wait, no, this went down. Yeah, this is back down. Yeah, it's only two. I was about to say. What? I don't know why it said going up right there. Whatever, who cares. Alright, let's get out of here. I think we're good to go. I'm out of alcohol. I'm thirsty. I'm out of grenades. I have cryo mines. I'm out of all other explosives. I'm injured. I'm irradiated. I'm running out of bandages. There's a subway line that way. The Metro Federation is guaranteed to be this way, so we're gonna go the guaranteed route. We're going back to the Metro. Uh, because we need to sleep. We need to get, you know, we're weary. We're in just in trouble, so we need to go back to the Metro Federation. We're gonna go straight there. We're not going to take a detour. I'm not gonna go the other way. I will be back this way, though, because I want to check that subway line back there. But this is the fastest way just to get to the metro. I, I think it's like, what, like a two-minute walk, really? Because there's no enemies over here, so it's just like a, a straight sprint. So it won't take long to get back and forth when I want to go back to check out that subway line. Because I do want to do that, like, right after I, I've gotten... I slept a little bit and, you know, rejuvenated. Also, I think I got cow meat from these before, so I can cook some of that up, which will be nice. Yeah, here's the metro. It's really close. It's a lot closer than I was expecting. There's cow meat. Thought I got it. I did not, but there it is. Any more? No. Maybe I did get it. Maybe that's just another thing that I missed. Either way, this is the metro. It is not the metro. This is just subway line. Never mind. I was wrong. The next one's metro. Wait, no, this is metro. This is the entrance to metro. Okay, whatever. Who cares? Let's go. Into the downtown. <sighs> just, just sit back a little bit. Just a little bit. Hmm. First thing I'm gonna do is visit. Well, I never actually went to the bathroom. Anything interesting in here? No. Let's visit the hardware store, or rather the gun store. Handy hardware. Let's see what he has to sell us. Hopefully he has new stock. I really yeah. hope he does, because that means the alcohol dude right. does. I'm sure I've got something you need. I'm sure you do too, Ozzy. Let's see what you got. Great. Oh. Um. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and guess. That means he's closed. So let's go into Siempa's bar. I'm gonna try to get some alcohol real quick, but they're probably closed too. I think it's really late. I think it's like midnight or something. So they're probably getting ready to go to, or they're trying to go to bed. So yeah, let's just go ahead and go to sleep up here. Hey, uh. Excuse me. Hey, can you just. Yeah, I wanna talk to you. It's really important, trust me. Just, uh. Just get out of that bed. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Thanks, cunt. I did yes. not mean to do that. No! <laughs> get up! <laughs> there we go. Okay. Eight hours. Ah. Nice, full rest. Finally. Now I won't be exhausted yes. anymore. Yes. There we go. We have infection, by the way. So that means... We can finally take our antibiotics. There we go. Hello, Siempa. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. No, I'm stuck. Did I just soft lock? Okay, no, I didn't. Hello, Siempa. What can I get you? I would like to get some alcohol, please. Sure. Beer, bourbon, Gwinnett brew, wine, dirty wastelander. Sure, thanks. All right. Um, vodka bottle. Can I like steal? If I get back there and just take a few things. Well, this isn't. They don't care if I pick this, apparently. I'm gonna try and steal some things here, because I really need all the alcohol I can get right now. Sweet. As long as I go hidden, it should be fine. I mean, this guy. Maybe I should have had that stealth boy. Oh, this stuff isn't even real! Yeah. Yes. I don't think there's any way I'm gonna be able to get hidden here. Whatever. We got some alcohol, that's all that matters. Alright, 
we're gonna have to go talk to the gun merchant. Let's go ahead and uh, drink real quick here, though. So, purified water. We are running very low on water, unfortunately. That should get us up to full. Handy hardware. There is a place to cook here, right? Was yes. it in there? I might have missed it. Hello, Ozzy. If you need a weapon, you've come to the right place. Hopefully, you're actually working I've got a now. Few minutes to browse. Here's what I've got. Okay, good, you are. And you have a lot of stuff. Good. Okay, what guns do you have first thing? You have Molotovs, Pipe Revolver Pistol. Okay. Uh, your armor is lacking. And your ammo's not, though. So I'll buy all your ammo. I'm okay with all of this. I want all of that. So yeah, buy all your ammo. I will give you in return. Um. Uh, no. No. Let's go to the junk. I could just offer him this and get all my money back. But, like, the problem is my weight that's going to come from this. Like, there we go. I can get my money. But the weight that's going to come from this is going to be a little bit... Oh, no, it's fine, apparently. Oh, okay. Cool. All right. Thanks, buddy. Uh, did I buy your, your Molotovs? No, I didn't. Let me do that, too. Looking for a weapon? Sure. Let's take a look. Here's what I've got. Yeah, let me buy those two on that at Molotovs, and I don't really, I don't want the emergency flare that much. Okay, thank you, thanks, Ozzy. We're good to go now. Um, I really want to get back home to store the hazmat suit. I forgot. I yes. I like completely forgot that was even a thing on me. Also, I want to cook. I don't know if there's a place to cook here. I mean, I'm sure there is somewhere. I mean, like, wouldn't they have yeah. everything? Is this armor? No weapon workbench over here, unfortunately. Looks like they refill these ammo boxes every, like, so often, though, because I think I looted those before and there was nothing there. So that's good. I'm going to look around a little bit, though, because I can't remember if there are any things that I can loot. Take some bandages. Or not loot, uh, cooking, because I really need to cook this food. But I, I cannot remember for the life of me if there's a cooking place here. Again, there yeah. should be, but... The access tunnels do have a cooking place. I can go that way. That goes back to the subway line. All right, let me just check Siempas after I check over here. Yeah, let's check Siempas and then I'm gonna go uh, through the access tunnels. Cause I know for a fact the access tunnels do have that. Yes. This is the place that would have it yes. if they do. Which I don't think they do. Nope, doesn't look like it. All right, that's okay. So let's go to the access tunnels and cook that up. Uh, we are low on water now, but that's okay. I'm trying to think how far this place is relative to my home. Huh? You know? Because I don't know where we are right now. We're not at the airport. Uh, if I go this way. How do we get to the north end? I know one of these places led to the north end, quote unquote. Wasn't it their way up or something to the north end? I can't remember. How did I how did I find the north end from this place before? I do remember seeing that. That's Valenti. Let's go into Valenti. Maybe it was Valenti Station that went to the north end. Because I remember specifically that their place here lets out to the north end. I think it was, yeah, I think it was over here. This is the entrance. Huh? Any places to cook? God, my radiation is high as fuck. Here's a weapon? Yeah! Nice. Okay. Sniper rifle. Scope. Um, yeah, I'll take some glow sights. Thanks. And this. Scope. I can't put, I need adhesive for normal sights. Okay. Cool. Look at that. Barely any sway. Or none at all. So, the magic of taking your scope off your gun. Okay, we'll save there. And yeah, let's get out of here. Let's see where the north end lets out here. Hopefully it's nowhere too dangerous. Uh, if it is, we just save, so it doesn't really matter. But I really hope it's somewhere s close to my place. The Alliance might be up here though, because we did see Alliance flood in here, so I hope they're not standing here. But I'm really hoping it's close to the Hangman's Alley. I just want to know where the entrance of the Federation is. I, I don't. I never knew. I always thought downtown was like literally downtown. I didn't know it was that was just the name of the station. But whatever. Man, 
the, that moment when you've never loaded the city before because you were at the airport the whole time and it, it gives you this long ass load time. Wow, the FPS here is not that great. Okay, where am I relative to Hangman? Pretty fucking far. That's not good. Does explain why the Boston airport is so close though. Okay. okay, that's less than good too. Oh, well there goes the, uh, the, uh, what is it called? The spaceship. That's landed. Good to know. Yep, there it goes. I just heard it crash. So yeah, the Federation is like, I want to see what their entrance looks like. Does it, does it say Federation on it or anything? Or is it just like, all trains? Yeah, it doesn't say Metro Federation or anything. They put like their signs up. You'd think they would have, you know? Because they want to broadcast it. They're not trying to be hidden, are they? They want to try and get people to go there, right? Well, it's not that much of a trek from here to Hangman's, honestly. It's maybe like a two-minute run. But it's a two-minute run if you're running. I'm not running, because I don't know if there's any enemies. It's actually probably less than that, honestly. Oh, maybe not. Oh, my God. So far away! There's a survivor camp. Let's just go. Let's just let's just see how far I can get if I just sprint all the way there. Please don't tell me there's Mr. Handy. Friendly Mr. Handy. Is there a are you still? <laughs> You're not friendly. Oh god, please don't come to life. <laughs> I don't want to fight that thing. I don't even think it's possible to kill that thing in Frost without a fat man. And even then, fat men are hard to use in Frost because your accuracy is so bad. I wonder... Does, like... I wonder if, if putting up your... The Rifleman perk gets the Fat Man accuracy up? I don't know. Because technically it's a... Is it considered a rifle class? Technically? It's a launcher. There? Oh! Oh! Fuck me! What just happened? Did I just get shot? I don't... I... I don't even know what just happened. Oh, dog. A dog just happened. He broke my arm by biting it. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I didn't even realize I was walking into a fucking area there and I just walk in and get my arm broken instantly. some mongrel meat. This is so much better than using the scope one, by the way. Although the scope one is still good against people. It's just the ghouls that they're the worst against. God damn, does not do a lot of damage though for this pipe rifle. And I've gone crazy, which means I can still hit. Oh, that's surprising. Uh, don't I have bourbon on me? Yeah, I, I bought all that alcohol so I can drink bourbon and regain my sanity. There we go. We're good. I'm trying to avoid killing these guys. Uh, I could get the intimidation perk, but like, see, the reason I'm scared to get the intimidation perk is because like, what if? You go to, like, you know, make them surrender, and they just don't surrender, and they shoot you, you know? Don't you have to get, like, somewhat close to make them surrender? Because you have to aim at them, don't you? Like, in a way that they see you, right? That just spells trouble to me. Please don't be a turret. Just trying to get out of here. I'm not trying to clear this place out. I just want to go home. I'm way too over-encumbered right now to deal any th with anything right now. There's just too much. I am curious what is here, though. Because here might be a very interesting place. I, I'm actually kind of scared what could be here. It's probably a bunch of survivors. This is probably a huge survivor camp right here, I bet you. I'm going to see like, like 10 of them. Because that would be the obvious thing, right? Could be ghouls. I doubt it, though. Could be nothing. Huh. Oh. Oh. I see. The Frost Dev has, uh, changed this place by hand. So, no, I'm, I'm wrong. 
It's not what I thought it was. I see, because a lot, like I said before, a lot of things so far that have been changed have been changed in a very carpet sense, you know. Change all enemies of this type, you know what I mean? Because that's the easiest way to do it, if you want to pull out a mod fast. Uh, but, you know, some places have been hand, you know, picked and stuff. This looks like one of those places that have been hand picked. Because, like, yeah, there's a fight that went on here. Alliance. It looks like it used to be an alliance. Yeah, okay. A serrated Chinese ulcer sword. Interesting. Actually, the hits better than my sledgehammer, so I will take it. Uh, so it looks like this used to be an alliance. I, I don't want to say base, because it's so small. Maybe an outpost or something. Oh, there's a Federation soldier here, too. And there was a fight over it with Federation and survivors and alliance. I wasn't expecting to see Federation here. I thought it was just survivors and alliance, like maybe they were fighting amongst each other. But nope, definitely Federation here too. And looks like the alliance were the ones who won. Because the alliance were the ones who were going to the surface, right? Because they didn't like the Federation, know how they were taking control of everything and trying to unite everyone under one thing. Yeah. Okay, good. This is a nice little place to stay in. It's not bad. There's some Gwinnett Stout here, which is always good. I didn't even really look for alcohol back there. I really want to check that, because if I don't check it now, I'm going to forget. See, that's that's a problem when you don't, you're not used to taking alcohol in runs. You'd never, like, if you see alcohol, you just walk right past it, because you don't ever think it's important. But in this run, it's probably the most important thing. There's some beer bottles. Because insanity is pr is literally the worst thing that can happen to you. It really is. There's no way about that. Or no other way about it. It really is the worst thing that can happen. Green shirt and combat boots. Got some of them combat boots. Yay. Mm. Okay. Nice. So we did get uh, the serrated sword, which is good. I'll get used to hitting in the head with this thing, but this thing is faster than the sledgehammer and it does more damage, so I'm hoping it's going to be better. I mean, I don't know. The sledgehammer was really good and it was a two-handed weapon, but this technically does more damage and it's faster, so I don't know. I think we'll be okay. Let's go ahead and save real quick because we did go pretty far. I do, I really love the story of Frost, like learning about the Federation, the, the Alliance and all that. It really is honestly super cool just like dust it had its own story this is nothing like the dust story by the way which is what i love the frost ev it, it feels like it's his own take on fallout lore because you know fallout 1 2 3 and 4 and new vegas all take took place in different areas and each area has its own lore just like fallout dust and fallout frost take place in two different areas and they both have very different lore because they don't take place right next to each other they're like you know different stuff happened in dust than it did here and i really like that i really really love that a lot but anyway guys see you in today's survival here hope you all enjoyed it and i'll see you all next time goodbye